Welcome everybody once again, GameStar coming at you with the coverage of the Cyber Gamer Amateur and it is time for some ownaged. My name is Don Miga, we just swapped maps, uh, we're going to Inferno for some reason boys. Yeah, uh, I think the knife round was done and I didn't even wait for the um, TV to catch up just to get the knife round and so they changed the map before the delay oh, can right. catch up. Oh, okay. That's generally what happens. If they change it straight away, don't let the um, viewers catch up on it. It'll just change the map and you won't see the knife round. Okay, so we can't give you coverage of the knife round. That's something that we can't do. What we can do <laughs> is show you all our lovely... If we can bring it up here, of course. All our lovely... Uh, no, we can't show you that. Because it's not coming up. We will press this one. Okay, all our lovely media. So we've got YouTube, GameStar Media. That's where you'll find us. GameStar on Facebook. At GameStar on Twitter. And of course, GameStar.com is where you'll find us there as well. And, uh, of course, Don Mega and Bizer are who you are travelling with. Real Mint and Brimstone is what you're watching. Now, Real Mint are number 7, Brimstone are number 12. But Brimstone are 7-1, and one. Real Mint haven't lost a game yet. 7 wins, 0 losses, Buys. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a, an interesting match. Um, they're both really close in how they play in styles. In fact, you know what? I'll tell you now. <laughs> I haven't watched them play, but um, just just having a look at the, the fact that only one team has lost once out of nine matches um, is going to be a night of epic proportions. Yeah, so we have Brimstone. The last two maps that they played have been... People have chosen Dust against them, and they've had to play that twice, and they've done really, really well. The third, uh, three weeks ago, they played Crowd Control, or they didn't play Crowd Control because they got the win, and Crowd Control didn't rock up. Then you have, on the real Mint side, listen to this, boys. Are you, are, are you ready? 16-5, 16-4, 16-5 are their winning margins. Ouch. I know. And then you've got uh, the maps are Dust 2, Inferno, and Overpass. And Dust 2 was chosen against them. So you do get the feeling that the teams are getting Dust 2 chosen against them. And they're still winning. They're still, they still seem to be able to beat the odds. Yeah, it'll be interesting. It looks like we've got uh, a ready up coming for Real Mint. They're locked in into the CT side. Brimstone onto the T side. Just a couple of formalities, and we're going to be going live in the first round of this action, Don. Excellente. We are on the map of Inferno. It is a best of three. You're watching the Brimstone Boys take Real Mint CGA action coming at you from GameStar. And, get some. Uh, get some. I'm going to put our Twitters up there just while we're waiting for this knife round to get done. So Don Mega with three A's is where you'll find me on Twitter. Biza is Biza1989 is where you will find him. We're about to do a knife round. And I think this knife round is to choose sides because we've already chosen the map. Why would you do that again? Biza, yeah. can you and are you going to take us into the knife round? I will, and I'll do it very well, Don. And they are heading down into the <laughs> midsection. Luke with his knife holding out in front of him. Says Aretna. We're just jumping around on the TV. They've lined up the CTs. As soon as this first shank goes, it's all on. Rington is just staring down the gun barrel. First one comes in. That's Hound, and he's getting banked down as Lukey gets one. Retina, oh, slowly moving it. The hook comes from Smiles as well. They're really slow, Don. They're yeah, they really are, slow. aren't they? Yeah, the, the, the real Mint boys don't seem to be, like, giving them an inch or a mile. They're, they're so close to each other, and they don't want to they don't want to split up. The boys, the terrorists, have now oh, picked them off boy. one by Let's one. The, the left away. and the right, uh, the left and the right flanks went down until there was only one. Metal Snake has to take down three people, but 45 and 12... 45 uh -huh. are there, uh, are there <laughs> he's not going to make it. the inevitable. Yeah, he is. And uh, now you can say tight, uh, stay or switch. And we're waiting for them to uh, vote to switch teams. Brimstone are on the defense as Buys is going to quickly read out 
some names for us and not screw them up. Are you ready? <laughs> I'll screw every single name up if I want to, Don. Righto, <laughs> CT side as we go live into the first pistol. Breamstone, CS. We've got Baz, Simo, Andy, Seeker, and Retina. Or uh, Retina, whatever you want to call it. Uh, that's the one I'm stuffing up there. And for <laughs> real mint, we've got Rexy, Metal Snake, the Hounds, or Hounds, uh, Luke, P, and the Smiles. We're in round one here. CGA action, Don Mega. The best of three maps. What are real mint doing? Yeah, we seem to be, we are looking at a typical 3-2 split. Two have gone to B. We're watching the terrace push up into this uh, into this banana section here. Metal Snake isn't the one who's going first. Lukey is just just behind him. And they are ever so, ever so careful as they move around the corner. Simo's already got the quick, quick headshot. Hound is hiding in the corner with his mates. He doesn't want to push around too far. He does, though. It's Hound that gets the first frag. Smiles is going to be shooting up through the smoke. Does get Retina through there somehow, some way. He's got him. Three CTs are left. And the Baz oh. is going to go down in the con. He will also be able to push through there. Hound is still there. He's got Andy once again. See? Seeker's taken one out, but Hound with the third on Seeker. Hound doing beautiful, beautiful yeah, work he's... here, boys, in that uh, construction area. Uh, Hound's just holding that wall, just his line, and every time he stepped out, he had a headshot lined up, hits the shot with the pistol. Nothing like an easy pistol around to uh, set your momentum. Real mint. Interesting, the work banana go up quite slowly, didn't rush in, and settled, uh, settled into the site with a bomb plant, held quite quite well that would settle some nerves for uh for a real bit, but that would definitely rattle brimstone and how they hold yeah we're watching a slower sort of hold here from the boys the metal snake is watching up through the mid i'm looking at hound he's just doing a couple of quick pops into the window room i don't think he's seen anyone as of now but we do have the three CT boys pushing quite close into apps. So he's going to find himself in oh. trouble. Quick, smart, oh. in a hurry. Metal Snake with the one. Metal Snake with the two. I missed that, but boys, tell us what happened. That was a double stack and Barley pops over and absolutely nailed him, Don. Moving around the corner now into this area in, into the bomb area the bomb is going down there's only two left for the cts that'll be retina and simo simo still in unders retina is doing a closer closer push looking around the corner is he going to be able to see anyone these guys aren't taking any chances they're not going to push him and hunt him down he's going to have to push them if he wants to get in, in onto that bomb site still looks like he's unaware boys whether they're going to for, whether they're going to force it maybe he's just waiting for a pick to see if they go in they've really got nothing to uh, to gamble with here so it really is just a case of getting some quick quick headshots Campbell gets Simo, Retina will pick up one, and uh, Retina is uh, able to get the Uzi, escape with 12 health buys. Yeah, it looked like they were never coming in for the retake. Uh, mm. 2v4 um, with, with pistols and, and SMGs for the real mint boys. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, too many people to contend with, especially when you get a secure A bomb site uh, planning over to the pit. Um, it's not easy to retake them just with two players done. Yeah, well, we're looking at Simo now. He's pushed down Banana. He's the only one on B. This is a very different hold from the CTs now. We've got Baz in the middle. He's been touched a little bit. You can see Retina lining up an early nade, and they're all sort of setting themselves up here for what seems to be a strong A hold. The bomb is over by the A side. The only person on this Banana is Luke, and I'm not sure, Baz, whether he's looking to make some noise or he is there to stop the rotation. I think he's just there to see anything's pushing. Saying that, Hound picks up the first frag into that carps section. Now pushing up Banana. Luke is the first player. Simo back in sight. Rotation's called very quickly by Brimstone. Oh. They're already around. So this might be a solder fest as they come in. Smiles is in. They spot out Simo, pick him up. Meanwhile, Baz and Retina working their way around in the construction. Got the smoke covering the clear. And oh my god, Retina just absolutely dinking everyone down that site as the bomb goes down. So we're ticking four players into site. More smokes going out. The CTs, are they going to retake this, Don? 
We can see Retina hiding in the smoke. We've got Baz behind him. He can be seen a little bit. Retina hasn't been touched, but Baz has. They're both waiting for the smoke to clear, I think, till they go in. It is... Seeker doesn't seem to be moving in either. There's still four of them. Baz will get the first one. He'll get replied on. Retina will also go down. Seeker will get pushed by Rexy, and that'll be the round. That's all of it. After waiting for so long to get into that bomb site, they weren't able to round those corners. That That'll be the third round in a row to Real Mint. And now we've got a real buy-up with a real round. Everyone's got M4s, AKs, and and uh, what have we got? Have we got a Galil? No. It's an M4A1S. Silence buys. Yeah, interesting, uh, interesting how the Brimstone boys don't push into a rotate and absolutely stack the hell out of Banana. And the frag has gone out. Simo Ritten is teaming up, oh, nailing it. Enough. Hound turns around and dominates both of them. Clears out that side rotation straight away for Brimstone. And this is surely a bomb plant down. If they get it, they are. So we've got Seeker and Annie's coming in for the Brimstone. Now, I was going to say they retake really slowly. Will they retake slow again? Or will they push in with some speed? A Molotov is set out by the terrorist. Now pushing around Hound, spots one, jumps back over to Coil to hide. He gets noticed by Andy, nails them out with the M4-2 on one advantage in favour of Brinstone. This is a retake they needed to do, and here it is. They finish it off. Snake goes down to the hands of Seeker. Defuse and guns up by the two CT survivors, Andy and Seeker. That's the round we've been looking for there, Don. Yeah, Hound pushed around the corner. He didn't get tagged because they were about to throw a nade. And then you saw him push back around. And they obviously knew where he was. There was only one place to go in that corner and he got done. So that's the first round from Broomstone. They they really, really wanted it after that uh, after the shocking couple of rounds with the pistols. We're seeing Simo and he's saving. How much money does he have? He has about 13 grand, so not enough to be uh, to be buying here. And uh, you can see the AKs spread out already. The 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 mm, we're not really we're not really pushing banana all that hard here, boys. We're looking we're looking as if wow. we're going for a slow A. Yeah, it was a slow A. They moved into the uh, the apps room, and Brimstone, Seeker, and Baz were holding very aggressive in apps, and they got that first pick on the Hound. So that's a very vital frag for them. Hound has been fragging out the last couple of rounds. Simo and Retina for Brimstone are holding a real tight line. I'll see if I can flick over to them and, and see how they're working it. They've got a DAC on a barrel, so they're, they've possibly got a really good shooting position here, but they do decide to push through. In saying that, Don, they have stacked, this is real mint, have stacked four, and they are working up very slowly. So we're probably going to look on 30 seconds and going to be pushing to site. This smoke's set. Rina puts up another one. They're slowly going, and it's slow play here, Don. It flashes out. I might just chuck it at you. We're they're they're going back. We're watching Metal Snake. He's trying to see over the. He's trying to see over that smoke for the coils pick. He can't exactly find it. He's going to go for a blind fire. He knows that there's someone on the glitch. He does go for a blind fire. They're going to rotate back now, and uh, they don't have a lot of time to do so. Ten seconds is on the clock. Oh! There'll be Seeker standing there. <laughs> Smiles will also go down. Retina's going to be travelling from the, around the other side. Metal Snake runs away. They're not going to be able to pick him up. He's not going to be able to plant. That, uh, I believe it was Seeker standing on that A-bomb. He saved the entire round for them, boys. Yeah, he chucked the uh, incendiary out. And um, <laughs> it's because they didn't leave him enough uh, time on the clock. Mm. They pretty much went in and tried to plant Shadow without clearing out the site. And Seeker just had a field day just holding that out. They do cause a rotation and a bit of noise at Banana. But in saying that, they really should have hit um, the B-bomb site on that time. They only had 30 seconds left on. Yeah, so we're watching a slow banana push once again. This might be the problem with some of these pushes is that they get slow. You get timed out after the uh, the clock runs out. But we're watching Metal Snake. He's sort of popping around the corner, seeing if anyone's going to be in sandbags. Basil take down Hound down around the other side. Metal Snake has been tagged, but he's okay. You can see Rexy standing there with the bomb. He's holding mid to try and see if there's going to be any pushes from anywhere else. Metal Snake now following up behind them. Smiles will be the first one to take one down, push it around that corner. They're going a harder B, a harder A push, I should say now, boys. Working into the site, another incendiary off. Baz picks up one, Seeker does get his flamethrower. 
And, and a two down with the AK, just as quickly as it handed over, it is gone. Uh, Brimstone bring back the scoreboard to level freeze, freeze on that par. And um, we will admit, what they've been showing us here, Don, is the good at pistols. When it comes to buy up and pushing into the bomb sites with a Brimstone hold, they're not very good. I, d I don't know. I think they're being so, so, so careful that they're they're wasting opportunities. I think that what's uh, what seems to be happening more and more is that we're pushing banana. We're going to see if we can get up there hard and fast. We can't. We're going to go for the rotate. Sometimes we run out of time. And you can see the Rex put watching mid to see, A, if they're going to push there, B, if they're going to get pushed from there. It's... Uh, it's it's a standard hold as far as the C as CTs go, boys. It's two and three. You can see Andy is uh, rotating around to mid. He's going to have a little bit of a dangerous poke, but apart from that, it is fairly standard practice here from CTs. Yeah, they're batting them through the mid section. Uh, the Brims don't have a standard hold, as you mentioned. Uh, Real Mint really, really looking for an early entry pick. Brimstone playing pretty smart, not letting them have that. In saying that, um, Metal Snake, he's just got a decoy in hand, so pretty tight cash situation for him. He's probably going to be looking to try and get a pick. Does he have a Deagle? He's got an AK. Yeah. No, he's got the Metal no, Snake. No, he's got a Deagle. The Deagle yeah. he's, he's the one watching over towards Pit. He's going for a couple of shots over towards that A bomb site. If you swap to Simo now, you can see him looking over towards the smoke. Still that hold on those banana pushes. How now? Walking around the A side, is he going to go around the world? He is not without some fire hitting him. Luki is pushing through the smoke. It's Retina and Simo getting no. him and his friend down. Now it's all Hound and Luki. Luki is uh, able to plant the. But no, he's not. He got uh, he got touched just as he was planting the bomb. He's only on six health. How Hound is going to be the one waiting it out. He's going to get no money for the round. He's going to be dead broke. And he's waiting it out at their spawn. There was still three or four... Was it three or four players alive for the CTs, guys? Uh, let's see. I think it was two alive that round. Two, yeah, alive, two alive, yeah. Yeah, but um, once again, Real Mint, really, really, really slow with how they work their rounds. When are they going to do a quick one, Don? As you say that now, we're watching Metal Snake. He's already pushed up to the hold, and, and uh, his mates are going hard and fast around the corner. It's Simo that takes the first one. Luke is in the response with the Tech 9. Not a bad gun if you're very close. He's not going to be pushing in too far, though, because the far away aim isn't going to do much for him. Metal Snake is the one pushing hard and fast onto the B bomb site. That's the take for them. They've taken it. The retake is going to now come from the CTs, coming from their spawn. Baz is looking at them coming around the other way Andy will go down and uh, it's oh. Seeker as well running away Baz will now go down as they hunt them out Seeker now the last one left is he going to push this bomb site with four of them on it this is a very very stupid move by him he's running right towards it there's four people on this bomb site and they all have above 50 health every single one of them so this is going to be a lot of work for him he's pushing around the corner they know exactly where he's coming from it's going to be Rexy that pops out first he's going to go down metal snake will get the response however as uh, rexy obviously called it out it's all tied here at four apiece and we're w looking at the top score as being seeker and hound both of their teams getting six above six frags above anyone else on their team boys really interesting that round from real mint they worked the banana um held one in the middle in metal snake i believe um and uh no sorry it was hound in the middle uh, trying to pick out some AK, but what happened is they didn't move the bomb in straight away, and it caused uh, one of the CT's Brimstone players to rotate back around um, to see if it, just, it was just a fake hold off. Uh, and then he got called out with that last one trying to retake. Now, you've got to back him in early game. You could save or you could go if you're probably around the mid half of um, trying to secure the mid rounds. I would probably save. So, back him in, see how he goes. Four players. He didn't know they were above 50 HP, but what can you do? So, uh, stacks go out, guys. We've got... Oh, it's a bit interesting. The, they've got a smoke two in, a banana two sitting mid. Hound is already in uh, apps at the moment. Andy and Seeker, sort of a strong hold on the truck and the pit area with the A. Arena is holding back of Archers. So, they're going to let them into A and maybe do a quick shutdown. Simo and Baz, very aggressive. 
Some beans, some shots go out. Senka right down now. 15 HP. Hounds onto 52. Flashes go out into the midsection. They are working around into the Dickety section. Luke P with the view. Sees one. Binks it out. That's Andy Oz. And he gets the second. Awesome. Pulls out the bomb at the wrong time. But Retina gets picked up by Rexy. They secure this bomb site. Two CTs left in Baz and Simo. And they're not moving, Don. They're not moving at all. Yeah, and it's... It seems to be a similar strategy to what the real Mint boys are doing because if you're down and you know that you're not going to be able to take five boys down, all of whom have a strong hold on this bomb site, you're not able to do it, so why would you bother? It's a bit of, of a defeatist attitude, but at this early stage of the game when money is everything, you really do want to hold these guns. And we're looking at a situation where they are hiding in corners and watching for these boys hunting them because they know that they want to be punished they will punish the other team by killing them and getting their guns they are able to survive and that'll push it to four five on this scoreboard with real mint coming back in a ways that we really sort of uh expected in that uh, if they get into bomb sites fast and hold them that is where this uh, that is where their strengths lie here boys It'll be interesting to see how Brimstone set out this round with uh, the two M4s in hand and where they hold. Um, Simo and Baz, well, you've got a four stack in jungle and fun. So, yeah, they're holding together, so they might want to frag quite nicely. Hound, once again, working in the apps, second mid. Smiles and Rexy just watching the middle with the bomb. So, real mint. Just going with a standard setup. Smiles with the ops. He's going to wait for a peak. Hound, a bit of a cage. In that mid section, I think Metal Snake's mm. going to push, going to get this site cleared if he can clear out Retina, and they're going to no go one on the site, on site. Guys. He hasn't even realised, and in that time, he's given someone ample, ample opportunity to push into this site, and that person is Retina, sitting at coils. He had all that opportunity to push into the site when there wasn't anyone there. Retina's going to fire through the smoke. He's seen two people run run in front of him and just having a blind fire. Metal Stake's no. going to get Retina and Seeker because they didn't check their corners properly. Rex, you can see someone fight through the smoke fires at him. Does so very well. Luke will turn around and get the Andy saving Rexy behind him. And that is the round. They pushed in beautifully. Once they know they had the site, they were on it. Within a second, bomb went down. CTs had to, had to rotate. Didn't do it fast enough and that's that's the deal that's what happens you can see on the ct side though buys all of them have the m4 none of them have the silence version of that gun so it's interesting to see that they're not real oh nice and control. smiles has an op op actually let's let's cross to him he's watching the standard spot in watching that mid from those hay bales on that ramp there another aggressive hold uh yeah. Not an, another aggressive pick strap from a real mint working up into the banana. Uh, they're all there at the moment, so it'll be interesting to see if they've got an, a rotate coming from Brimstone. And Andy and Baz are working as Seekers worked all the way down second mint, so a bit of a ninja work might be coming from the sneaker man. He's got the M4 spray down. He could absolutely dominate Hound and Luke if he just has a look. Let's go to him, see if he's going to do anything. Yeah, he he sees, sees one, he does. He snaps it out. M4 onto Luke P. Don Mega, how's the rest of this round going to go? Yeah, Hound's trying to respond on him, but unfortunately, he wasn't able to pick up any touches on him. Hound is looking to go all the way around the world, and he's going to have a little problem with that because he's going to about to be, or soon to be, shot from library. Will he get past? He will be able to get past. The Metal Snake still wandering, wandering around that banana corner. Hound has to push up very fast to enact this pincer manoeuvre. He will fire! He'll miss! Oh. That is an enormous miss for the team that was waiting for him to get around the corner. Metal Snake will push around the corner, try to do something for his team. Smiles will take one down on the on the on the. Uh, on the back foot here, but he is desperately on the back foot because Rexy pushed in, didn't do anything. Smiles now has to hide in spawn. There's only five seconds left. Even if they didn't get into this bomb site from there, it would have been a hard plant buys because it takes three seconds to plant that bomb. They only had like 11. That is that is a, not a lot of time to take those two players down. And unfortunately, they put all of their all of their eggs in the hound basket going around the world. It didn't pan out for him. Yeah. If he'd made that shot, it would have been a completely different situation for real men. They would have had a bomb down in a site clear. 
Brimstone um, let them do that. So it's very worrying by them that their holds are not absolutely secure at the moment. The fact that one of the real mint guys can walk halfway around the map and almost frag out and sight on the pincer maneuver mm -hmm. um, is, is telling you something that Brimstone are not all there with the CT rounds. Um, in saying that, Real Mint, six rounds already on the T side, so they are going to quite an advantage. They are working banana right now. Metal Snake gets Rena as the Simo returns the fire to the favor. Luke P, aka, and he gets smashed out by Simo. Hound gets on the return, and they're going to put that bomb down. Slowly, they're going to put that bomb down. So the rotating coming from Brimstone straight in and, in, and Baz in construction. Seeker with the AK is covered with smoke, puts the uh, and set an area out as they both work around. All three working for construction. Smile goes off onto one. He spots out the second onto Baz. He goes for the third shot and oh. misses it out. How and with him off as Seeker gets the smiles. What a battle that was, but a real mint just taking a real advantage at the moment. 7-5 um, on the scoreboard. It looks like they're going to pick up a couple more too here, Don. Yeah, the ult was saved by Hound. Lucky for Smiles that... Uh, he was able to do that in a quick couple of seconds that he had at the end of the round. So that is the 5-7 going the scoreboard. The, the top fraggers, you've got 14 for Hound on his team and 13 for the Seeker on the other team. Very, very interesting styles of play. Very different styles of play from both of the two boys. So we're going to see Metal Snake doing the same thing that we've seen him do every single round previous is that he will push up and sit on these uh, the boxes here looking over towards this banana not really being able to push aggressively and risk all of that in saying that hound over the other side of the map pushing up and through he's going to be pushing an aggressive a andy will take him down over by oh. boiler metal snake now is get, is trying oh. to push this site to give them something to hope for and they're going to follow him right in there. Retina's going to have a busy, busy time. Pushes around the corner, gets taken down by the Metal Snake. Now it's Baz who is the closest one to this bomb site. He has to move around and take four people down. He's only got the 5-7 in this save round. Unfortunate for him, he has to do it all with that gun. He has something, he has nothing to lose though here, boys. So he can push in effectively through this and try to take a couple of these boys down. Yeah. As through construction, Simo just waiting, bomb planted, uh, and smiles with AWP waiting for that crossover. I think what they're going to do here, Don Mega, is they're, yeah. they're going to catch the exits and try and pick up some guns in the process. Luke Case working around the corner, he will they spray out Baz, doing. They know, and, they know metal, what doing. and Metal Snake will pick up the Simo. Of course, they know what they're doing <laughs> as the bomb almost takes them out as they try to get out of sight. So, Real Mint picking up another round. A bit of domination um, in the last uh, last six rounds. They've got five out of the possible six. Uh, Brimstone eco once and the eco again. Um, there's eco for the for the last round, so it'd be interesting. They want to go out with a bang. They're, both of the eco rounds have consisted them of holding four players in the jungle diggity section of a bomb site, and both. Real Mint um, strats have pushed up the banana, secured the bomb site and the plant. So um, Brimstone really got to work it out when they eco. They've got to play a different strat in saying that. And my favorite saying, um, <laughs> they're working up the midsection and smiles with the bomb second mid metal snake, a lonely, lonely self at the B bomb site. They do have a free stack Brimstone. So Real Mint pretty much have an advantage to ready to go, Don. Yeah, we're watching them push around the corner now. They've got the fire superiority. Is that going to be enough? Because Metal Snake seems determined to stand on this corner for the rest of his days. Luke P will get will pick someone up. Metal Snake will drop Simo like a bag of hot potatoes. He'll do, he'll do the jump glitch towards the the coils. Will he be able to see anybody? He won't. It's Retina and Baz that are the last two left now. After Luke P took down Seeker over the other side of the map in that pit area, the bomb's gone down. Now they have to do the quick rotate and are they going to do it with these p250s i don't think they will baz is just looking for these exit frags retina is running completely the opposite direction baz pushing around the corner no. getting a nice frag on rexy Lovely. will he risk it and cross over to pick up the weapon is what we're all trying to determine because there is a person there the time is going to run out however you can hear it tick 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 ticking down and uh retina will go down in the, get the gun stages and baz will he push in and get the gun he has 
A cheeky good little boy. Little, yeah, good <laughs> cheeky little pickup from Baz. He Gets only up. had a couple of inches, a couple of centimeters of health left. Yeah, yeah, he waited out and they didn't go down the archway. They head down to second mint, so he got himself a gun. Uh, and a bit of money for this last round of the half. So, Real Mint really taking the advantage. 9-5, Brimstone got a bit of work to do. They need to hold out this push and how Real Mint are going to work. And once again, it's a slow play by them. Uh, Brimstone with a standard setup at the A bomb site. Retina and Simo holding a nice crossfire at the B. So, Real Mint need to work in. Once again, our favourite man, Metal Snake. He is the entry fragger when he decides to poke around that corner, Don. Uh, Real Mint will probably wait for a certain time. Molotovs go out. Looks like the action's going... Not going B. Yeah, Metal Snake still looking to absorb some of this damage they're popping his way. Firing through the wall and the smoke now that someone's popped it right in front of him. That's unfortunate for him, but he still has to deal with that. You can see Seeker now has moved from the apps area all the way over. And Metal Snake will take him right there. He'll push him. Go to the left. He'll take him. Uh, he'll take the Simo once again. This has all been a classic case of misdirection because A is completely unguarded. Everyone else is there. And that is exactly what they wanted. They wanted these boys to think that they were pushing B when, in fact, quite the opposite is true. Retina will get dropped to a P2, a P250 in the mid, and that was the round and the half. Looking at the scores, buys. 14 goes for the Seeker. He was the one pushing through apps the whole time. The entry fragger on Metal Snake, he has 12 frags, but uh, he's only... Well, Rexy only has four. He's not he's doing the, the team things. He's the dedicated <laughs> bomb carrier. So you can see the, where the score and the frags don't necessarily line up, but you can see how the score is much more balanced on this CT side of this real mint team than it is on any other team. Real disadvantage for Brimstone right now. They've got five rounds. Uh, they're on pistol. It, the first three rounds are very vital. They don't get them. Real Mint can be 13 rounds up with a couple more to go. They could be coasting. So these first eco rounds done is very, very important for Brimstone. Yeah, we can see a similar sort of push out from them. As you can see, the, uh, the one person, as I'm trying to find him, in this... It's Simo in this... Uh, banana area he's he's been firing at walls and all kinds of things trying to get their attention their attention is firmly fixated on this standard rollout of the three two push well looking at them firing up mid all oh. guns blazing everyone's running around crazy like hound has already got one of the kills looking through this archway he's going to be He's going to be watching there with careful precision. Metal Snake, our favourite, is looking towards Diggity to see if they're pushing around. They've gone the complete opposite and gone right around and oh, right back to their spawn. Smiles now has a lot of work to do as they push around the corner. It's going to be Seeker that gets the response on him. Seeker pushes around the oh. coils and gets in. And he'll get the bomb plant points. Very nice little passage of play for Seeker. Could have done it all himself if he wanted to risk it, if I do say so, boys. Got to risk it, the biscuit, and he... <laughs> oh my god, I found that. As they do push in real mint, <laughs> Rexy, the first one, he gets seen and uh, dinked out of the banana from Simo. Seeker will go down uh, to Rexy as Metal Snakes. Just trying to figure out Simo. He's trying to work that bomb. Oh. He will get taken by the Metal Snake Man. They did come off the bomb, and there's no kit there, Don. They probably will still get this. Yeah, it's going to be very, very close. I think he might... Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, oh no. Just got it. That was an amazing, Hello. amazing round from him. As uh, who, who was it that just went down last? I can't I can't believe that he just waited. That was Simo. Simo. What a classic play. Just the, the last bee's dick. The last bee's dick of time that he needed. And he wasn't care. He wasn't had a, a care in the world about the two people shooting at him. He only cared about the person defusing the bomb. Headshots went out. And no no, kid, no clue, mate. Yeah, that's right. No clue. No clue. It's only four hundred dollars. <laughs> you should be able to invest in one. As we're watching, the only uh, the the weirdest gun I think is a C7. That's been employed by the Hound as he's pushing this out. The fire power is oh, going to be very hound. beneficial for him. He's going to get replied on in the back by Retina though. She's uh, or he. They have been pushing up second mid with their buddy. The bomb's been dropped at mid, and they're going back for it because it does look like it's another. Uh, well, another banana push here, boys. The whole map, I feel like we've seen banana pushes. 
banana, banana, banana. They're pushing in. Baz loves one with the, uh, the Galil just spotting in the back of the barrels. They work in a slight slowly. Simo picks up wow. one, picks up the second. They only clear out the construction. However, the real men have already rotated. They're already waiting. And uh, it looks like they're back in the other scenario where they, um, they're going to now set for uh, exit picks. Yeah, it's exactly the same situation, but reversed. So you have Rexy where Baz was, and you've got Metal Snake where oh, I, th Baza. I think it was Simo in the last the last half. So Rexy now is the last one left. Going for the exit picks, got the Guardian skin, and will he be able to pick up a headshot? Does get a headshot. Simo will take him down, though, and Simo surviving that round with 16 health, not quite getting as far away from the bomb as he would have liked, but nevertheless, he was away. So, real mint now with that three-round lead. That's going to be beneficial for them. The bot, the... The, the round tallies have been shifting somewhat with the last two rounds going towards Brimstone. That's going to be very, very... They can, I mean, they can make the... Wow, I'm looking at all these bloody nades, boys. <laughs> Third round of the second half. We've still got the Ecos out. Nades go out. Retina on to Rexy. Smiles gets the Simo. They work that banana scenario. And uh, that is real meant. They have pushed quite aggressively into the midsection. As Brimstone work around Diggity, they're in that bomb site. Hound and Luke working through the archway back in the site. This is going to be a quick. Well, I was going to say it's going to be a quick push in, but they've just held off the bomb, giving Baz the opportunity to lay the bomb down. Ran it onto Hound, picks up the major fragging player as Luke pops around the corner of the mid, picks up Seeker. Baz returns onto Snake Retina. On to the Lukey man. So we're leaving a one on one as Smiles gets Baz. Pit versus Diggity. Hoover went out, here he goes, pushes in, bang, bang, <laughs> chicky, bang, bang. <laughs> oh, that was pathetic, really that, was. Bang, bang, that chicky, was bang, bang. You can see... I was, thinking, I was trying to think of something else, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you can see two health versus, uh, I think it was about 30-something health. So I think the health war uh, worked out in their favour in, in that sort of scenario. The, the defuse will go off. Real Mint will take it to 11. That four-round mm. lead going to be very, very interesting to see how it plays out if Brimstone can uh, can increase this lead. Looking at the rollout now, it seems to me that the bomb is going A. There's three standard, standard, standard from the CTs, but this very, very hard, very fast uh, push from these boys is something that we sort of haven't seen yet. Well, we saw it last round, but we haven't seen it in this game yet, boys. Yeah, nothing setting up Banana as they got a smoke there. Hound picking up the first from second mid with a lovely shot onto Baz. So the uh, Brimstone boys, they've just got their AKs. They're going to chill for a little bit, see if they can get a couple picks. And Rexy and Hound holding both Diggity strong with metal. So it's a stronghold for, for Real Mint. This could absolutely turn into a frag fest here, Don, as Retina, Andy and Simo work into the apps. I believe the time's going to be called as the smoke sets out. Smiles and Luke holding the B, uh, B bomb site. So, Real Mint do have a, a one man advantage if they can push out at the same time and pick up the frags. Seeker and Anzor. Let's go. Here we go. The call's been made. Hound gets one onto Simo. Well, not, it hasn't. They actually stayed still. So, and and they've played the abs quite smartly. Metal Snake's absolutely be, uh, incendiary out the. Um, the app entry and pushed them right back. So Brimstone on the back foot, leaving it down to the last 20 seconds. They have to go now. The flashes are in and real men are set up. Metal Snake will go one. Rex will pick the second and absolutely dominate the end with Andy. So big round by real men holding off Brimstone. A lot of slow play by then, Don. Yeah, we saw we saw the exact same thing the last half. So it must just get down to that last couple of seconds when you know they're not rotating, they're not taking this this bait that the teams still seem to do where we'll send one B and he'll make a lot of noise and then everyone will rotate B and then we'll have four and A. That's only worked one this game, mind you. One time this game, mind you. So it's not really something that we're looking at. Oh, looky! Uh, Luke has now the scope. He's already taken one down. He's looking at... Uh, 
from coils over towards that sugar area. Very nice from him. Baz is half health. Andy has also been taken down a peg or two. Seeker is there in response and Retina is right behind him. So it's going to be a very interesting push with the pistols. Andy's going down into the health. Seeker is going down. Retina's going down. They've ran through some sort of fire. Retina will go down. Luki will take uh, Retina. The Seeker man will try to get an outro, an exit frag. He won't be able to do it. The CTs then, boys, didn't lose a speck of health. Not Like, not even one HP was lost by the CTs just then. Uh, very strong, very strong. Uh, Super smokes strong, set, yeah. Very strong. They, um, the smokes are set out and the banana and brimstone was just pushing in and wanting to get that bomb down. So, no real fragging force coming from then. Um, Brinstone have been, oh, sorry, Real Mint have been playing semi-aggressive and uh, they've been changing it up on the CT hold, so it's very interesting to see how they play. That stronghold of um, Rexy, Metal Stake and Hound, that's something the uh, Brinstone boys really need to stay away from because they're doing quite well. They might, and that's funny, they've got a four stack at A and one at the uh, Banana Bomb site, yet they don't work to it, Don. Yeah, they, they just don't, they don't seem to be very confident in their pushes here at all. You can see the one person still doing this, uh, this, this banana sort of baiting. It's Simo trying to look around the corner to see if everyone uh, has moved. Rexy's got a nice one too. Baz will get the response though. He will move up to pit, trying to get the pit player. He will. It'll be the hound going down. Baz, very nice, calling for the bomb to move up from mid. Now these two players he has to deal with while this bomb is coming here. Luke, he has the AWP, and he's going to be watching one of these corners very, very carefully to see if he's getting pushed or not. Smile, still not, still not moving, even though both players, he still thinks, but boys, oh, here we go. He's moving now. And uh, Luki is uh, looking around these corners, trying to get one of these pits. He'll get flashed. Doesn't matter to him. Yes, it oh. does. Luki, uh, Simo will take him down and drop. And the AWP will get dropped. The first one for this half. Smiles now has to take down two players. Simo and Baz. Simo has a lick, lick of health taken from him. But Smiles now will have to do all this work. He's already in there trying to get the headshots on Baz. Can't do it. Takes him 50 health. Will get responded though, and that will take down Smiles and Real Mint will push their lead out to five rounds here, boys. And uh, the, the biggest fraggers for this day are the Hound on 22. He's really extended this these frags. Just amazing work from him. He could have got, he could have gone a bit more bigger if he held out in that pit section at the start of the round. Great round by Brinso. Um, working working together and having that carpet plant. And uh, oh, far out. Screw the analyst. Go straight into their round action. Simo with the with the HG and an AK frag coming from the Brinstone boys, getting a two-man advantage already. So they're working up to the banana. This is what I wanted to see. Metal Snake and Rexy still holding for room. So Luke will go one. Don't. Thank you very much. Don't mind me. I'm just going to take an AWP onto you. He backs off into construction, waiting for the boys to rotate. So he's let Brinstone in for an easy plant on. And all the mackerels, Metal Snake goes with the M, with the HG. Toby, Alchi, absolutely nailed him on that. So we got these boys free on free for the retake. It is on. Metal Snake comes in, picks up the one. Rexy pushing through construction. There's an alt there from Luke P. They've got to work out that smoke. In goes Metal as he gets Anzor down, leaving one more in Seeker, where it's the man, he is sitting banana. He gets one onto Snake, sees one, sprays out the Ninja Defuse is going to happen. He's jumped off. Oh, that bomb's going to blow. Oh, Seeker's no, he going to have the one off. HP. He's jumped off, and, and Seeker, what a clutch out from wow. that man. He held held off Banana. He clutched out, and uh, you know what? Real Mint could have the Ninja Defuse, but he got chickened out big time as Seeker pushed in and held, held that bomb to blow. He still had that second worth of smoke that I think would have benefited him. I, I mean, I don't know why more of these CTs aren't buying diffuse kits. Rexy has the least money and he's got the diffuse kit with him. So and my, he must have learnt something from the last round, hopefully, because they have not bought any this round and they've got money to spare as well, which is unfortunate for them. Maybe the save will come out. Luke P, you can see him very flashed. He's hiding in sugar. He's got the man with smiles. He's on four 
health. All he needs is a light breeze to knock him over. Simo doesn't realise just how close he is to these two players. He'll pop around the corner doing a little bit of fire. The smiles is still so, so close and so, so low as Simo oh. is still trying to get around this <laughs> corner. He doesn't know where these boys are. He'll take down Luke P first. Smiles will reply, though. Four health. Thank you very much. Rexy will be the other one over by the A site, taking down the players on that on that truck. And uh, Smiles still shooting through the smoke. It's a 2v2. Not bad odds. As Smiles shooting through the smoke, trying to find where this boy... He, he knows that there was someone pushing him, but he's not quite sure whether they're there still or not. Retina and Andy are the last two players for that team. They're still trying to push up through the smoke. They don't realise that Smiles has oh, only wow. four health. All they need to do is... Wow, they've walked right <laughs> past him. Oh my God, this is a, an amazing Metal Gear solid moment as he's coming up the outside. Fail! Fails! Oh, wow. To get the... To get the frags, an amazing missed opportunity from Smiles as he could have saved this bomb plant. Something fierce. Rexy will have to do all of this work himself. He's been flashed and smoked up the yin-yang. He's moving right up the middle, seeing if anyone's going to come out of their shell. It'll be Retno. It's very stupid. Now he's firing over towards Andy. Andy's been half-tagged. Rexy only has five. It didn't seem to matter to Smiles. It won't matter to him. He pushes in anyway. And Andy will take him down in response. That's two in a row to Brimstone. Fearing, feeling very well... Three in a row, I should say. Feeling very confident about themselves now, boys. Smiles, oh my god, that was, uh, <laughs> I don't know how to, how to describe that, mate. You had every chance the, in the world to nail them as they went past you. You had the opportunity to do it and finish it up before they got that bomb plant. That could potentially set Brimstone up for a victory. They are behind here, ladies and gentlemen. They are three rounds behind. Well, they've got momentum and cash. Um, well, hold on, they don't have cash. They've got two Tech 9s and three AKs. I bloody lie. Real Mint. I've got a full bite set. So they even though they won that round, um, they're really short on. Yeah, I'm not sure what it is about this about this money situation that seems to be ticking over, but neither team seems to have much money whatsoever. You've got the full buy that's uh, that's made the CTs increasingly increasingly poor if they lose this round they're going to be on a pistol round the next one so they have to be very careful unless they force then you've got the t's who did buy up mixed buy and you've got retina standing around pushing mid just with the tech nine trying to find the, any sort of player to steal their gun looking around at a thinking that there's nobody there popping a flash at least we bought one of them we've also got the molly someone's shot at me i'm going to turn around and go the other way while the rest of the team sitting in this banana sort of area where we've seen so many players get holed up time and time again try to push in he doesn't do it retina's come up and followed with the response simo's been the first one to push in gets around the corner on 16 health very nice from him setting up the bomb site the bomb will go down that has put them in a nice little state smiles very low tagged where have we seen this before very low tagged hiding in the smoke thank you very much Baz looking towards that spawn. Andy also looking there. Baz will take one down though. Rexy will reply on him. Andy and Retina taking a cute few quick frags. It's all up to Smiles. He's got two players to deal with, both of whom don't want to give this up. The bomb is ticking down too far. He doesn't have a kit on him. He's going to have to hightail it out of there, but he'll run into Retina, who takes the takes the round and the M4, if you don't mind. That's a nice little bit of play. The CTs don't really have all that much money, boys. They're going into what looks like a full save. Yeah, if we, if we have a look at the rounds uh, and how many Brimstone have picked up last, if you look, there has been clutch situations where uh, one player survived. So that's the reason why both teams have been tight. And even on this round, um, there's still Tech 9s from Retina and Andy. So, you know, they're buying as much as they can with the nade power, armor, and, and whatnot, um, and, and paying for it. So they really need to get around where they all survive um, if they're going to hold on to their guns or anything like that. Early, early picks go out. Hound is down for the real mint boys. They are on a full eco. Two flashes with smileys. The guys have set up on a 2-3 stack. Free to the A2 to the banana. Seeker will pick up the AK. 
clearing one more out in Metal Snake. Just left on left is Rexy. He gets noticed. Baz picks him up, so the A side is cleared. Simo goes back to the bomb. Looks like they're going to A here, Don, as Luke picks up the banana as they push and rotate. Yeah, so they're going to have to do a lot of work very quickly. They've got four plays to take down. They don't have, they've both got two flashes apiece. They're going to get picked up in mid. Baz will take down Luke. Smiles will get out of there with his life. But what sort of life is it if you have to do with four players in mid pushing you? And, well, three players in mid pushing you. The fire will come up, and that will be the round. That will end. We've got a tight situation, a tight ball game here, boys. 12-13. That was... That was a very, very nice comeback from Brimstone, I must say. The last five rounds have been theirs, and they've done it with, you know, as Watch you said, out. less than one player. And uh, we do have a lot of uh, a lot of players left when the uh, when the real uh -oh. players have been have been, uh, uh -oh. have been left. That's We're watching how now the fire on Simo Basil push in. He'll get taken down, and now we're watching Retina and. Andy, is Andy going to go down? He will. Uh, sorry, Seeker will go down. He was in front of Andy. Andy's now look, doing a couple of left and rights. He's got the bomb. They're going to push him very, very close on this bomb site. They do find Rexy and Smiles over by Library. He pushed in too far, too fast. Couldn't do it. Luke now. Last one left for him. He's got an M4. He's got a full arsenal of flashes and smokes at his disposal that he's opted not to use. They have used it in response to him, though. Looking over towards Pitt. Will he be able to find them? Retina's on the corner, about to push around and find him. He will get the frag, and that'll take him down. They're going to pick up a couple of guns. That was very quick, very nice, very strategic bit of play from the Brimstone boys. It was quite unlike anything we've seen so far, boys. 13-0 on the scoreboard here. Brimstone have picked up uh, a massive T round. It seemed to be a T map, this uh, this game. A lot of a real men had a lot of rounds on the T side. Brimstone are picking it back with the domination. Shout out to our hound man with the AWP last round. Picked up Simo as he tried to work the garbage chute um, and absolutely dominated. Did get uh, returned, but always like a bit of orb action at the start of round one. <laughs> yeah, we do. Watching a lot of chickens being destroyed here. I hope you. I hope you're willing to eat them after you destroy them out. We're watching the Rexy. <laughs> Look at the. Well, I mean, nobody likes a waste of breast, do they? We're watching. No, no, no. The Get push some. through mid, very sort of reminiscent of last round going towards the left rather than the right the smokes and flashes have come out are we going around the world it seems that we are nice and no, around the world like this, this is something that we haven't seen from them yet this game we have seen it though from hound Luke will take down the player and Andy trying to push for the blitzer. That won't happen. Smiles will take down Simo and Baz. He'll take down Retina as well. Holy crap, that was the entire team. Metal Snake is coming in response, but why do we need him when we've got Smiles? He has just taken down three of the four players that were alive. Seeker is the last one left. He has to do it all with the AK, but Smiles did it with. The, uh, the P250, very nice bit of play mm, from mm. him. The one, the two, the three. He seems to be one of those players, boys, who can get himself into a position very, very nicely. Either they've walked past me or they've walked right through me, and I'm going to take them down. Yeah, that was interesting. It was holding in a position which would usually leave him open to a banana hold. Uh, and you know what? Both teams have tried the Peninsula maneuver, and both times failed miserably. Um, where they could have actually gotten to that site and done quite well. So round 28, guys, we've got two more left, including this one. Uh, and it is some close action at the moment. Real Mint with the advantage, one round up, 14-13. Brimstone have done a lot of work in the second half, picking up consecutive rounds. But Real Mint, that might be the round for them that holds them a steed and gets them across the line. A minute left on the clock, ticking Simo, Andy, and Andy holding the banana. Baz with the central... Retina and the Seeker on the apps. He gets taken out by Rexy holding that line of the graveyard. So they're trying to work this midsection, cause a rotate, and then work up Banana. But they're going to have to get this pick. Rita gets one onto the hound, picks up the major fragger, and opens up jungle. Now going to push around Rexy. 
He's not sure what he's going to do. He's going to have a look. Rena goes around Archway, so he, she, he or she, <laughs> he's going to definitely work the around the world. As Smiles comes back with the AK, finishes him off. So leaving uh, the push come from the T-side Brimstone. They're working in with the smoke set. Luke Smiles or Cran, a crossover very handy, but doesn't work as Anzi gets Luke. Smiles onto and Anza return. Take a breath. For a second, as Smiles comes around the corner, wow, and smiles. Just, oh my God. just as quickly as they got into that site, they were gone. And uh, Real Mint, like I said, they've got that momentum back. They picked up those two rounds done, and surely uh, this could be the GGs go out. Smiles, as I said last round, he just has that positioning power to put himself in the position where they he watches the line from coils and across. So as soon as they cross his path, headshots will ring and rain down like bells. And we're watching him now look towards Banana. He doesn't realise how close he is to someone pushing him hard around the corner. Who is it if we can find him, please? And uh, it'll be... Oh, Simo. No, it'll be Andy. Andy and Simo pushing around that banana sort of area. Not pushing too hard, mind you. Just trying to take a little bit of a break for it for a while. You'd think that a Tech 9 rush here, buys would uh, give them some sort of, you know, a Tech 9 rush is a Tech 9 rush, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, generally it is. They made a bit of noise in the apps just to pull smiles off its line. So if they work quickly now and. Um 50 seconds ticking on the clock. They will move in the next 5 to 10. Smiles comes around. They're getting set for a takedown here. I'll leave it with you, Don. So we've got Andy pushing around the corner very fast. Runs into a little bit of fire. He's not willing to go, but Baz is moving in. Moving around the corner while watching Retina firing through the smoke. Andy also there. Simo moving around quite well, wondering where these players are. There's a lot of smoke. Smiles will get one. Smiles will get two. Smiles with the with the massive takedowns. He'll get responded by Seeker and Basil also have a little bit of a shot. Simo will fire up through and get Luke. That'll be him. He will have to do it all, and there's three of them. That'll be the GGs that go out. When they get onto the bomb site, they need to take them down and not just stand there, boys. Yeah, they, uh, they work to the bomb site. They jumped over the top of the booster because there's a lot of smoke, uh, smokeage that was holding the entry. And generally, when you've got players playing back of site, they can get an easy pick out of a person running through the smoke. So they needed to go over the top. They did have that advantage, but as they dropped, um, the boys are ready for them as they push through the smoke. So, not easy. It's it's not easy being like that, especially when you're very uh, your strats are very slow and you um, you work into the game. One thing I've got to pull out of that map, um, out of both teams, is the entry faggers. Apart from um, who was it? It was Snake. Part of, there was only a couple of players that Metal could entry fag. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The rest were really, really struggling for that map. So it'll be interesting how they do it on the second. It's so hard to push in when you're by yourself. You can't run through the smoke. You might get instant headshot. You've got to remember, too, that the teams that you're playing against have lined up headshots so that they know where to shoot, even if you're covered in smoke. So it's not really fair to say that they could flash in or they could smoke in or blah, 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 because that would still mean that you might get headshotted. You don't know where they've lined up through those smokes. You don't know how that sort of practice. So that is something that the, you have to remember. And Metal Snake did it really well where he would come in really slow but really sort of structured where look at coils right i can see coils from here i know that he's not here i know that he's not there and he can push in like that and that was a huge benefit to the team even if they weren't going to go to the b it, it's just nice to have the option and real mint did did fantastically as uh as metal snake doing that the other person that i want to talk to you about that was who was it I had something lined up for this, boys. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, while, while we're waiting, while Don Mega tries to uh, sort out what he wants to do, yeah. a big shout-out to the Twitch world uh, and the guys listening and watching. Um, I do have the chat open, boys, so if you do want to have any shout-outs or uh, any comments, we will read it out during the game. Uh, give us your pick. The first one went to... Oh, my God, I lost who the first one went to. Real mint. Come on, play, pay attention. Yep. <laughs> I got lost in your sexy voice, mate. You're just talking all that time. Mm. All right, so what I'm going to do, it's guys, a... is uh, pimp out our social medias once again because we Good really man. do need those likes and those subscribes from you. That really helps us out a lot. 
So, uh, especially when we're trying to pimp out a cast like this when you want to see us live. So, Game Star Media is where you find us on YouTube. It's where this will be after, after this. So, this, this after, this after, you get what I mean. Facebook is Game Star. If you use Facebook, you should give that a like. That'll get you some of our videos and all that sort of social media sort of uh, those posts and everything that we do. Then we have at Game Star on Twitter. You've also seen at Don Mega with three A's on Twitter. That's my buys. You have at Buys a nineteen eighty nine on Twitter. Is that right? I don't know, do you? That, 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 that sure is. Yeah, yeah you're, I'm just start, I'm starting you're just to guessing. You're just guessing right now. I'm starting to use it. Okay, well, Bizer's, you know, behind the times I've got by about 10 years. So don't worry about him. The next thing I need you to, uh, to look at is www.gamestar.com. There's not um, um, much there now. We know that. But what we're going to do is in the future is get that big red button back. And the big red button is our subs is our request a cast button. So if you do want us to jump in the game... Can't wait for that, boys. And uh, just just say random stupid things is what we can do. That's And sarcasm is just another service that we provide here at GameStar, boys. Yeah, sometimes I get too serious, but what can you do? <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> what we're doing yeah, right. now is we're on the map of Mirage. I'll just show you what we're dealing with. And uh, if you were playing along at home, that is Don, at Don Mega. That's at Bizer1989 or whatever. So we're just waiting for... We've got Lukey P, Smiles, Hound, and Rexy from the from the real mint boys we're waiting for the metal snake man that's him he's just joined don't worry about it boys he's here can't wait to see how the boys play out this map um who do you see going last year don who do you think will be the entry fraggers on this one it's, it's very it's very different to inferno and in how you play um a lot of smoke smoke strats to go out so who do you think will be taking it's, the... it's really about mid i think for me this map is really about mid but some players just have the ability to be able to push into a so fast you know you've got the blokes rushing through palace you've got all the smokes that everybody lines up on the terrorist side they line them all up from that from that little ramp there you know and everyone lines them up and we all push in together as a big unit so you've got that team right that's just one of the, the that's just one of the strats that you have the most teams have like the basic strat for this map and then you've got the holding down mid so whoever wins the first couple of knife rounds gets enough money to buy the orp first you get the good orpers in Lukey P or whoever the hell you might have holding down that mid section. So it really oh. is very interesting. We've got some team damage happening here, but the first two kills will go to the terrorist side. We're getting a lot of damage. And now Smiles, the last one, once again. It's all up to him. And uh, he will lose it for his team. Now we're seeing whether the terrorists, who are the Brimstone boys at the moment, are they going to stay staying. or are they going to go? So I think they're going to stay, boys. So they're just staying. running through the teams once again. I mean, you have to play both sides anyway. So it really is just for those first couple of rounds. So running through the teams once again, if you've just paid attention, if you've just joined us, we're watching Real Mint versus Brimstone. Real Mint have won the first map. They are consisting of Rexy, Metal Snake, Hound, Lucky P and Smiles. The Bazman is on the first team, is on uh, the first player for Brimstone. He's joined by Simo, Andy, Zor, Seeker and Retinor. And these Terrace boys are going a B mid. Are they? A B mid. Oh, wow, they're going B mid right out of the bat. It's probably the safest time to do this buys because i mean everyone has a gun a, a pistol a pistol i said yeah, a pistol yeah. that's what i mean. Every, everyone everyone's pretty equal baz has gone underneath and he's just molotov out the mid connector orping spot i like to call that as they work the short section rex has been caught out in the uh the smash out from the tech nine hands or he pushes into sight see so cleans it out so they have that v easy easy done easy cleared metal snake baz cleans it out as metal snake's the last one so quick one brimstone Wow, interesting, interesting play. They were sitting, setting up for that, um, and they just waited for Baz to work the underneath. Molotov out that uh, mid connector. Um, what do they call it? The the window section. Sorry, mm, the Molotov window, that yeah. out, and then they worked B quite strongly. Yeah, well, I wonder if Brimstone are really strong on this map. It's probably too early to say that, as we're watching them. Uh, we've only got one K. 
AK. A couple of Galils have come out, and Baz is the one with the AK red line. He's pushing up through mid, getting the player up the stairs down on low da on high damage, low health. Metal Snake will be the first one that he gets, however. He'll take him down. The Hound was the one that he was shooting at. Retina will reply on him. Lukey P will push up to Andy. Andy will take him down in response. Baz now is sort of cleaning out the Tetris sort of area, going towards that A ramp. He'll find Smiles there. Smiles waiting in that sort of sneaky sort of spot. Rexy has the USP, and he has five players to deal with. He shoots at the player with the most health. Andy Zor only had six HP. He shot at the play with most health. Obviously, he didn't win. You're watching it. We're watching it. So he didn't win. That'll be the first two rounds of Brimstone. I think they'll get the third as well because they've been able to buy the sexy weapons. Seeker's the one that has the. Uh, well, I didn't press on Seeker. Seeker's the one that has the Tech Nine. Everyone else has nice weapons. Buys. How do you? S oh, we've got Hound with the CZ. How do you see this one? Oh well, I see them working the bump side eight on. Oh, you <laughs> see what I mean about sarcasm? Just another service we provide. Smiles has got the first frag. Baz will get one and a touch on Metal Snake. Rexy will go down as well. It seems that everyone I'm switching to is losing their life from these boys. Lukey P is the last one. I tried to switch to Hound. He wasn't, he wasn't there anymore. Lukey pushing up through the connector. He's getting fired on from from someone over by the B bomb oh, side. He knows that they're going to be pushing him. It's Seeker. The Tech 9 worked out beautifully and they have some uh, money and some guns to show for it. Now, this expensive CT side gets to buy their weapons, buys. For buy-up rounds, we're at round four. Brimstone giving a bit of get some to the real Mint boys. They really start started this map off strongly, taking the first anti-eco rounds and uh, giving them a bit of a real advantage into it. They first worked at midsection, they worked it second again through the con into the A and that time was worked through the, uh, the what do they call that? They call the T ramp. They worked for the T ramp. So very interesting. You did say it was all about the work in the midsection and they're saying that they are working through the connector through mid retina on the first the metal snake as they clear out the A bomb site smiles to stuck in the firebox and into decision hound and Luke both oh. rotating through spawn. And oh wow smiles gets picked up too Luke and Rexy Dominating what the hell happened to Brimstone? They were setting into this side. Where the, they got in where the hell did Brimstone go? They, they were in. They were all through that connector. They were all in there in smiles and the cross. Oh, wow. Absolute I mean, uh, domination. You can only do that so many times, boys. You can't, you can't pull the same crap against good teams because you just won't. You won't be able to effectively do it after the third time. They they get wise and they know what you're doing, and they can get what and they can uh, work up to it. As I say that, the MVP from last round, arguably Metal Snake on the donut here, as well as Hound, who was also very very influential in that round with the pincer maneuver around the country. So. Uh, it, 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 it might just be the map, it might just be the side. We don't really know how these players are on such low, low scores. We're watching Baz now trying to push him through. Apps can't do it. Lukey P already with the AWP, already having pot shots. And whoever the no. stupid enough to go into mid, it's Simo. Now you've learnt that he's got the AWP. Don't go there again. Seeker pushing onto this A bomb site. Doesn't realize how many people are going to be descending on him in a second. Needs to get some quick frags. Get smart. Miles. Metal Stake will respond in turn. Retina on that uh, A ramp. Trying to decide if we're going to risk the bomb being dropped in A when there could be as many as four players on it. There's only three, so the guess is not all that bad. Lukey P looking over towards there. Has a bit of a pot shot. Retina and Simo Andy. All of those players getting nice little frags. Retty P and uh, Lukey P and Rexy will get the last little frag. What was that, boys? I don't know what Brinstone are thinking, but like, uh, they, that should have been a B. They they wrote they were set up for B. One sit into sight. He clearly got nailed. And the problem is had, though, pretty much the B is so far away. As soon as that ten seconds passes, they know that you've stacked up at A and you haven't gone in. As soon as that ten seconds passes, they know that you're going B. That's the problem. Yeah, but they were at B. They rotated around, and that's the problem they did. They should have just stayed there and worked through because it caused the rotation. But you know, each to its own. They did work in that site, and it was poorly pretty much executed. They had Tech-9 trying to pick out guns. We weren't going to go anywhere. 
Yeah, it, it is true. Technon's on the long range. We are seeing Rexy, though, poking out from that ladder room, getting a few through mid, and one of them, Simo, poking once again in mid. Unfortunately for him, didn't have the, the utility to back up the, uh, the ballsiness that he was showing. We're watching the stack up on the, the apps. We've dropped the bomb. It's for the last player who is the, uh, I think it's actually Seeker is the designated bomb bitch for this round. We've got Baz. He's <laughs> only got 52 health. And he looks like he's going to move in after this flash comes out. He knows that there's someone on this van. They know we're here. You have to move now. He gets through. There's a lot of fire. Don't want to drop into it. Oh. He does, though. He gets taken down by the hound. Retina will respond. Very nice from him. Seeker will get the bomb down. Retina watching short. Having a look. Popping some fire into market. Metal Snake Smiles and Lukey P. Some of the MVPs for that team are all coming out to play. Smiles will take Retina. Metal Snake with the pincer on the Seeker. There wasn't much that they could do. Three players all descending at the exact same time on that bomb site boys there's too much to deal with at that time you can't do it you end up losing the bomb and the round three all another really close game here yeah good retake in the end by uh, real mint pushing in brimstone probably probably what it should have done is just hidden and played mm. out the bomb play for um, time yeah the, yeah they, they end up peaking and working the corners and i think it's just a blood rush momentum they had the first three rounds uh, and they now lost the last three. And oh, Luke P, oh my god, almost picks up the shot. Simo does the round and absolutely nails him with the AK. So that is a viral frag for Brimstone. They're going to take in an advantage. They will start working. That bomb is in the B region of the stairs. Renas is going to wait for a push. Hound and, and Rexy playing a real defensive B. Andy, has he worked? He's underneath. And Baz is working that short to B. Simo just waiting that. So. They're going to wait for another pick, Don, but I think their strat has to work around the 50 seconds. They don't want to be doing anything too early. Yeah, they've lost the last three rounds, so they do seem to have lost a little bit of the momentum, realising how good of a hold that the CTs have here. They're trying to get some more picks before they push into A. It looks like they are going to go that way. Smiles with the... Can he get it? No, he can't. He's been taken down by Seeker. That's a very strong play from him as they're trying to push in. Rexy and the Hound now. The Hound in that window room takes down Baz. Rexy only on 14. You wouldn't be. You wouldn't think he'd be con contributing too much to these proceedings as he'll move in. Very flashed. The Hound's still taking very heavy fire from both the stairs and uh, looks like we're pulling out, pulling back and not going in there in a hurry. They don't realise, boys, that everyone is under 30 health. All it'd take is a couple of good sprays. I mean, the Hound has full health and full armour. I mean, you know, Rexy only has full armour, but the Hound has full health. You don't really... I don't know. I, I, I would have gone in. Yeah, I think it's a call of... Um, it's 4v2, man. And you got M4s. The money is slightly tight, or they're going to have enough to buy... Um, buy out the, the full kit and maybe drop. So save your guns instead of being really, really tight because, you know, if they didn't save those two, maybe in two, three rounds' time, they'll be doing a double eco. Yeah, that's a good point. But in saying that, Lukey P, he's still got that AWP watching up through mid. The other AWP is in the hands of Andy Zor, and he hasn't gone mid whatsoever. He knows that going mid is so, so old school in this map. Everyone goes mid with the hop in this map, boys. Just everyone does. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how he picks and Lukey, man. I won't actually watch this. Where is he? He's yeah. waiting for him, yeah, too. he's looking over towards connector. Luke knows that they need, oh. they need the mid. Oh, Andy! In the Battle of the Scopes, Andy comes out on top. We've got a lot of holding, a lot of movement on this a sight smile seems to be day, positioning Tom. himself, has it? <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> my day. That's what Andy. I wanted. I wanted Boom. an orb battle. That's all I wanted. Yeah, the orbs are the rock stars of the team. If they, if 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 this was, if this was a super group, say U two or something like that, you know, one of those musical groups, the orbs would be bon Bono. <laughs> You know, oh, God. obviously. Smiles getting yeah, the Baz. Yeah. He'll get res 
responded on from the Retina. Retina moving in very nice and Seeker will take down two. Nice bit of play from him. Retina will move in as well, taking down one, uh, him fire through the smoke. He, I thought he was going to get one because Rexy is standing right there in the smoke, receiving all of it, having none of it. He's firing up through the towers, trying to get that headshot. Seeker will take him down with a nice three from that round. 60% of the team he killed. And that is a nice little bit of play. Broomstone have, have got the last two rounds. This map isn't really all that CT sided though, guys. It's very, that's why one of the, the you know, Mirage is, apart from Dust 2, very, very even in terms of uh, sidedness between teams. It, it all depends how you work your frags yeah. and uh, and where you push from. We're seeing Brimstone going straight into the A bomb site through the ramp section. Seeker getting one Marina on one smiles, one onto Baz before cool. he picks up a second onto Re Retainer, <laughs> Retainer, whatever. Simo on to the AKs on the smile as they work the bomb site. I'm getting thirsty here, Don. Uh, Rexy and Luke just holding a, a real chilled out crossfire, and Bink goes wow. bang. Luke P dominates Simo onto that bomb. He heard that bomb going to get the plant, but Seeker will push through, finish it off as the smoke was set. Spray through the smoke. That is another round to Brimstone. Real mem that was an echo by them. So they did quite well to get the uh, get the frags on the boys. How many did they get down? They yeah, they got three pretty... frags on the echo, which isn't which isn't too bad. And see, it's the pretty good for them. power is almost even. There's no orbs going over towards the CT team. And they've got M4A1Ss, so this is very interesting from them. How the other team decides to have the M4. The whole team has still got these A1Ss in their possession. The nerfing comes into play a little bit with these teams as you, uh, as you uh, receive these updates from the CSGO. And they play around with the weapons. However they wish, you've still got... The only person down for this round is Retina pushing in very stupid. We're watching Andy pushing up through these apps. The bomb is near them and two other players are as well. There's not a convergence except for Hound. He's going to be moving up through, getting Andy, getting Baz. Nice little one, two, one, two. He'll get rushed. Seeker will Call take down the him down. The reload exactly how he went down. Seeker now pushing in very fast with Simo. He'll oh. get he'll get one two by Luke. Doesn't know where Luke is. Has to turn around. Gets a headshot. Rexy is there. He's moved all the way. He's travelled a long distance to get there. Very nice little bit of play from him. The buying power of this. Uh, well, actually, I should say Seeker has quite a lot of money. He can be buying the entire team at this point here, boys. Yeah, yeah, doing very well. Uh, Real Mint, great, great round that round. The um, a lot of rotations coming from the boys working around the sites, but Brimstone probably really slowly worked the B when they probably should have done a lot faster. Um, shout out to, to Merley in Twitch. Uh, he wants to know the best of three scores. Real Mint took out the first one in Inferno, 16, 13, and this is the second map. So, so uh, big shout out to you, mate. Anyone else in Twitch gives a shout out. Round action coming here. Round 11, Baz first onto Rexy. Hound returns to Simo as the terrorists just work out the picks. Hound sitting in the back of spawn, working to B. Luke holding the B as well. So, Don, they look like they're going to, Brinstone going to work another strat into B, but uh, Real Mint might be waiting for him. Can I just geek out for a second? Seeker has a stat track AK. If you switch to him while he's got it out, he's got 20,000 kills on this. So this is a gun that's well practiced and well versed from him. Even though you've got to remember too that it's all competitive kills. So that is a lot of damage coming from him as they push on to A here. There's, the Retina will take down Lukey P, hiding in the corner. Seeker will plant the bomb. It's a 3v2, not bad odds. Hound will push in, oh. getting the Retina. Will he get the bomb plant? The Seeker's moved to his right. Can't see him there. Seeker turning around, getting the double, but Smiles will be there. Excellent, excellent, excellent positioning from Smiles. Once again, I can't stress enough how impressed I am with Smiles, the way he positions himself in these, in these matches. It's just, uh, you know, he doesn't go where you'd expect him to go. And that is why he's getting frags so consistently in these teams, boys. Yeah, yeah, he's d he's done quite well, especially Inferno. He did very well holding out the A bomb site uh, on the CT side. So doing doing well for his team. It looks like Brin uh, Real Mint holding well with frags. Metal Snake, that's a bit weird for him on the scoreboard. He's anchoring at the moment for their team. Uh, Brimstone Seeker's definitely doing well, and especially getting to that site. 
almost clutched out. Too much noise for him. He couldn't pick up the last round. So, guys, we're in round 12. 6-5 in favour to Brimstone. And Seeker with a massive shot out of Palace. Oh, up Andy. The man. We're just calling and smiles. Adams are onto the hound. The action's moving here, Don. It looks like that bomb is rotating back around to A. Yeah, in the, in the Battle of the Rock Stars, Andy was in mid and the Hound was there with the M1 a, M4A1S, which isn't an ideal gun to watch that sort of situation. We're looking at the two players left in the form of Rexy and Luke. Luke pushing, firing up towards Palace, can't make anything of it. Rexy pushing in towards Connector now. He's looking over towards Jungle, doesn't realise that there's a player not there. And watches over towards Bombsite. Simo will be the one to push him. He'll get the headshot. The stairs, very well guarded from him. 5-7 go the scoreboard. Guys, if this is a best of three, so we could be looking at a potentially a third map here. What do you reckon? Where would it go on the third map? I, to be honest, the only map that we would go to is Dust Two. That is the, the most popular map ever. Both teams have played it over over a, uh, a, a Dust Away twice for Brimstone. Dust Two was the last one for Real Mint. So the, you've you've got to say that the the maps that they're playing have have included Dust Two so often that you have to you have to have to go Dust Two next map. Have to. Yeah, it's really it's really interesting. I, I don't know what they're going to do. I reckon they might go a bit of Kasia overpass. Um, interesting to say, Brimstone. They haven't done smoke strats. Uh, really interesting. They've just worked picks. They've worked the areas. No smoke strats here. Usually you see this map, T-side, dominated by the smokes. Yeah, but this is something that they have in spades. They've got the long range and they've got the Andy on the AWP, which is fantastic for them. And that's been boosting their confidence, especially on these long ranges. They know that they're on a pistol buy. Smile's doing well, but can he keep his team in this in the pistol round? He's just picked up the AK, which is beneficial for him. Doesn't realise that they're going to be Will in a oh. second now. Rexy taking down one. That's very, very handy for his team. Andy's all's AWP. He'll have to deal with the smoke, though, which isn't ideal. Smiles has the AK. This almost might be the round that they were looking for to push them back into it. Luke is the closest. He's going to be firing over towards the bench. Does get a little bit of a touch, but can't make anything of it. Now, switching to Baz, looking at him, five health. He's not going to be doing very much for his team in the, long t in the short term. They're Retner saving. And, Retner and Simo. Now, Lukey is picked up Baz. Simo taking down the Lukey and uh, the two V2s. Rexy will have the and keep the orb. Smiley will have the AK. They just weren't. They they just didn't commit in time. I think the time wasn't on their side. This is what I mean, by is When you have to rotate from A to B, you've already lost ten seconds. So when they've got the bomb down and you're at A and you're over at Palace or at Ladder or wherever the hell you are and you've got to get over there, you've got to move, check your corners and get over there quick, smart, and in a hurry. Otherwise, the bomb's almost already going to go off. And if you have to compile onto that, you have to kill two people as well. It's just too much to deal with. Yeah, way too much to deal with. It's 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 one of those long rotations that um, every map has. Oh, and Andy, you get brilliant! Out, oh, I just saw it off the side of my screen. Sorry, I didn't catch it. Through the smoke. I, I didn't. I, <laughs> didn't I, I was watching him and I didn't yes, see it. I don't know how to. I don't know how to comment because I don't know what I saw. I don't exactly. Oh, a bit know of action coming out of the B side. Luke with the AK seeker onto Luke. They push into the B bomb. Oh, sorry to cut you off, Don, but they were coming out very fast. Rexy gets a carry on, Simo finishes the return, so the both in sight and Hound goes one with the AWP. Can he get a couple more? Seeker will get the metal snake, so it's a two on one. Hound with the AWP sitting at the window. Ooh. Picks up one and ends or Hey mate, I'm the better AWPer in this game. Finishes them off. So Brimstone 9-5 as we go into the last round of the half here, Don. Brimstone, well... They're doing absolutely ownage at the moment. They're dominating. Yeah, it seems to be all this B side as well. Like, we take the bomb B side and we seem to get the round. Now the bomb's gone A. And it's the only thing going A, I might add. We'll, we'll be very interesting to see how this will change. The Seeker Man is is doing a very, very careful hold of this A ramp area. So, uh, sw switching to Andy now. Is he going to be pushing out towards mid? He has. He's looking to take down the, his opposite player. Simo will take down the Hound, though. 
Baz will take down Brexy. This is a nice push in from them. Baz now firing through the smoke, pushing onto this bomb site. Lukey Peel did the last one. Seeker takes down two. Lukey Peel respond with the two as well. That'll be a 1v3 situation. Is he going to go for it? You may as well, son. It's the last round of the half, pushing in through this oh. CT ramp here, taking down the retina. He has to deal with all the fire. Not going to reload the gun. No time for that. Just pick up the AK and move. He's looking over towards. Oh. He didn't realize Seeker would be on the top of that. Box. And I and a headshot nice. too, Don. Very nice hold from Seeker. Didn't want to didn't want to get nervous and push it. Didn't want to sort of lose his spot and lose the momentum. Seeker on that map. Have a look at that. Twenty bloody two. That is a man carrying the absolute hell out of his team. He's doing he's done so well in set up Brimstone with ten rounds on the T side. We we're talking earlier how even this map is uh, and potentially can be a more favoured to the T side, but if you've got a CT stronghold, um, it can be very equal. Brimstone to pick up ten rounds after losing the last map, it's very good for them, Don. Yeah, that'll push their confidence way into overdrive going into the third map. And uh, Real Mint will be a bit confused, I think, because they won the first map. It was very close. Now the second map they lose, if they lose, not so close. But there might be a turnaround here in the form of picking up a few rounds very quickly. If they can get this round, they'll get a couple more, and that'll be that'll be nice for them. We can see a couple of touches. Nothing really happening. Seeky getting touched. Retina getting touched oh, wow. as well. There's Priest and... Pl there's Priest invading our playgrounds with all the touching going on here, boys. Well, well, Metal Snake was thinking out uh, Seeker, and he's caused the guys to rotate. And how easy did Real Men just work into the B bomb site? It's an easy plant, and they're all set up. Uh, Metal Snake, however, did get fragged, so it's leaving Seeker and Anzor to try and pick up this pistol round. Real Men with real holds. Seeker, the man. Just switched off to him, and Hound picks up the one, and the Rexy onto the Seeker. So, how easy was that just for um, Real Mint just to work in? Brimstone just let it, left it right they open. They did make it look easy, didn't they? I mean, I, 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 I probably wasn't easy, but they did oh, it was, make it, it was look all very, Snake. They do, yeah, well, of course it was. Metal Snake has to do something in this game. He's 4 for 14. <laughs> I mean, you need, him to, you need him to start firing. This is a perfect opportunity Anchoring for him. Anchoring hard, mate. Well, I mean, he did. He he was the MVP last round. Let's give him some credit with some credits due. You do yeah. need him to start firing. We've got a lot of Galils on this team, so with the with the update, the Galil has been changed. A lot of people find it much easier to use. The spray pattern's been changed. All that sort of mess. So teams are now using it more and more. And uh, the Famous wasn't changed at all. People still up in arms about that because it's almost unusable still. So it's very interesting to see how that how this round will play out, especially with this Galil buy. They've only got one Uzi. That's in the hand of Metal Snake as we were talking about before so he'll be the first one to push in on this connector I suspect Andy Zorg will uh, go down Seeker will go down Simo having receiving a lot of damage as well and the Rexy replying with the retina where are these players going boys this is just such know. a different team <laughs> this is such a where the, where the shit was this real meant the first half I don't know yeah, don't, we <laughs> Yeah. I'm sorry for <laughs> swearing. Worried, it's it's really it's. I mean, they're turning it on their head. Yeah, and the language warning. How... This car's down, mate. <laughs> well down, well down. People on the age of 13 cannot watch this. Sorry, guys. Don't make that's it all my up. fault. That's all. That's all my doing. <laughs> 18th round we're pushing into now. Everyone's feeling a bit of the squeeze because we've been sitting here talking for a while. These boys have had to have full concentration while playing for this time. So it is an enormous task to go to a, four, yeah. a third map. Nobody wants that. Yeah, the question is, will they go to the third? Will Real Mint pick up the next round, get momentum and take it home? Um, well, Brimstone holds really well. You know, they've got the working stacks, man. It's so interesting. Is they had a, I think they had a four stack two rounds ago in the B bomb site, and um, they they're leaving A quite open. Seeker has gone a bit aggressive on it, and he has been banked down. So the T's are just setting and bringing real defensive to see if these boys push. They know they're on an eco. Hound picks up the first onto Simo, clears him out, oh, and nice. he gets his seconds. Oh wow, they're getting. Doing quite well, Hound. He might go for the third because there's two more in there for him to frag. And so we'll pick him up. So we'll get that metal snake works into the bomb site of A. However, now real men are in the A bomb site. Held off the uh, brimstone guys from going. Seeker will come through, get up the metal snake, leaving a three on three situation. Seeker will 
I'm saying that. No, two on three. You know, still three on three. I'm getting yeah. lost in Sinka the. Sinka has uh, no health right now. Absolutely yeah, getting lost no. in his health bar as Enzo with the pistol working around. Baz has gone to the connector. It looks like they're disappearing. Baz has gone back to save. And Enzo and Seiko are going into sight to try and clutch, which is a bit odd by the teams. Uh, and as I get some of the smiles, Luke will pick one on, up on him. That will clear the side out. Rex and Luke will save their guns. Real Mint going up another round. Baz, very questionable for Brimstone. He left his players out mm. high and dry. Even and if you don't want out. to go in, if your team goes in, you have to go in. Because yeah, if, right, they, right if, they, if the they risk their lives... For you, 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 you have to be able to risk your lives for them. That's all about the trust that, that, that these players have to, you know, you have to trust that your team is going to do right by you. But we are looking at the, the orb from Andy, so it's going, to be, it's, it's going to be interesting to see where he goes. If we can see the switch to him now, he seems to be running towards the window. He's going to go into that classic scope position and pushing himself over towards that window, looking to see if he can take down three or, or five you know, on a good day, buys five would be exceptional. Taking them down in mid. Yeah, just sitting with Metal Snake at the moment, sitting in Palace. He's just waiting for a bit of a Randy push. They're not going to do it. Baz sitting at the box and Seek back at the uh, what do we call that box? The CT stairs. They're all all these boxes got different names. I don't even know them. Uh, Anza in the window, Retina just holding that short of B Simo, just chilling out. So Brimstone. Not moving at the moment. They're just waiting for a bit of a pick. But, however, Real Mint are setting up for the A bomb site. The flashes have gone out. Now the smoke is set. A Molotov set by Metal Snake. He's trapped in pallets and can't get out. As Hound picks on to Baz, he's working that box section of the connector. Seeker's still staying put. He doesn't want to go anywhere. He's got that clarion on. The bomb goes down. So now we're set. Real Mint have this bomb site will brimstone come back in they're all sitting ct spawn stairs they start to push luke p gets into simo seeker returns that frag frash comes out to reader and the connector ouches he didn't know how to take that he decides to step out as smiles gets seeker and zor off the shit out of smiles holy oh, oh, he's now. swearing now hey metal <laughs> snakes is still in his palace and retina well he's gonna go disappear and Enzo. Another day defeated for Brimstone. They'll let this bomb blow. They can save their guns. And uh, that's well, Anzor very lucky to get away with the Zorp. So we'll look for him this round. But there will be a forced buy-up situation for Brimstone. I believe this round's on Mega. Yeah, um, Metal Snake was trying to run away. He he just got caught. He didn't he didn't have much health, so he got caught by the by the bomb blast. He's now sitting on four for fifteen, coming in for twentieth round to advise. So that's going to be very disappointing for him. He's either tired or low blood sugar. We're looking at him pushing in very fast. Oh. Very nice from him. And Baz, Metal Snake, Simmer, all rounding out some of the kills that you've been seeing. Now the last two for that terrorist team are Smiles and Lukey P. Lukey P and watch Smiles go down. He's going to get the retina. He's going to get a headshot on Simmer. Oh. He'll get responded by the Seeker. Look, waiting at that CT area. Seeker will be able to pick up Andy's AWP. And the AWP, I think, has survived more rounds than any player on the, any of these teams, boys. That was a really, really quick round by Real Mint. I yeah. did not expect him to work that a, um, a bomb site, uh, and I, I honestly think they maybe called the eco. That's why they yeah. went really quickly. Yeah, and you can see another eco now, and a lot of them are moving up towards the, uh, the apartments. Metal Snake, the only one sitting towards this A, making absolutely no noise at all. The rest of the boys, very, very quickly moving up through those apartments want to get that bomb down in a hurry metal snake not uh, not performing a pincer maneuver but actually trying to just waste some of their time over at a the lukey p should be the first one to go in but it's actually in the in the hands of hound who goes in he's been tagged one health but he'll still move in fire towards this uh this bench area looking towards the player the, trying to find him there he's been found hand, hound has gone down metal snake has been able to get a kill over at the a side that'll be smiles and lukey p now surviving to keep this bomb alive that's got to do three players one of whom has the orb and lukey p seems to be intent on poking that'll be seeker that takes him down lukey p will get the retina coming out of the market will he be able to push no. around he's had to deal with all of of that fire almost lucky. taking down the seeker the seeker 
Brilliant, brilliant game. He is now almost on 30 buys. That is just such a hard carry for his team. They wouldn't be anywhere near the, the round tally that they're on now if Seeker wasn't in play. Yeah, he's on fire tonight. Absolutely dominating. If he didn't absolutely do what he did. Uh, yeah, absolutely on fire. Absolutely going nuts. Um, if he if he, did, he wasn't doing that, Brimstone would probably be down and Real Milton would probably be taking the second map and finishing his game. Yeah, so we're, we're watching the... Uh, the rollout from these terrorist boys it is spread like vegemite it is just all over the place watching the, these <laughs> players almost stand on each other baz terrible. will get the, oh no it's such a bad simile i don't know why i used it <laughs> baz will get the first one on hound and uh smiley will be there trying to get this player almost dropping on the head it's it's retina the black retina man oh the flying through the air and getting shot right down. That's three players down for this round. They'll play no further part. Smiley looking towards this connector to see if he can find another player there. Can't looking over towards the window. Want someone to poke him. They won't. It's Rexy, Metal Snake and Smiley now. The bomb is in the hands of the uh, Rexy man who is coming unders. Metal Snake is already at A, looking over to... Oh, big shot from Metal Snake. That was who they wanted. Oh. Baz over towards the window. Will Smiley be pushing in now? He will. They might be able to take this bomb site if they're quick and good enough. The Simo man is still over at B. Simo, a seeker they have to deal with, though. He's the one on A, causing all the fuss and all the drama. He's about to hit 30 kills, if not this round, very, very soon. The bomb is in the hands of Rexy Hill. Planned it before checking this CT area. Firing over towards that headshot box. Does get a little bit of a touch. Oh. Through the smoke gets Rexy right in the face too. That is uh, off. He's ripped his head off like a, you ripped the head off a corn. Metal Snake would respond on Seeker though. He's got the fire to deal with. Now he's just trying to play for time. Smiley's also there. Firing over from jungle. Metal Snake will, get, will take that opportunity and take down Simo. Metal Snake's around. his guard. And... That was hard fought. I mean, they, real men are really looking to close this gap, guys. They don't want Brimstone to push any more rounds. They really need to close this out. They really need, this is the problem with attacking, I think, the second half. You can lose your focus a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to give a big shout out to Metal Snake that round. He uh, solo worked the A-bomb site and um, gave his teammates the opportunity to work connector. He also caught out Andy Oz as they were in the rounds. I think there's some um, eco round here from them. Yes, there is. The first one down is Seeker. That's a major fragger giving Real Mint a real advantage. Luke go the uh, AK shot and ends in sight. As they sit in Palace, Rex is sitting at the ramp. We'll flash out and pick up Baz. Massive shots as they work right now at the back of the side. Oh, big dig! And Max of the Nails, Rexy, Luke onto Simo. He's still trying to bink, bink at the back of the site. Luke P will go the third frag for the round and finish it off. That's a quick eco gone from Brimstone uh, CS. And Real Mint have pushed back the round. So after a really dominant half, 10-5 um, in favour of the Brimstone, it's now 12-11 and Real Mint one round They're away from drawing this at the moment. Oh, the um. Are they going to go for another push? Yeah, time? they're going another eco, and it's going to and it's going to mean that these teams will be tired by the end of this if they don't don't do something different. I mean, you can see the the similar sort of re rollout. Seeker's already been taken down by oh, Metal man. Snake. That is an amazing takedown from Metal Snake. They really needed that, but now they're two players down. There's still four left. That is a sizable op opposition if you've ever seen one. Simo's dealing with his problems over at the apps area. Andy getting taken down to half health. Smiley will respond oh. on him though. Lukey P will push unders with him. That'll be a nice little push from them. Taking down the retina as he, put, as he tries to poke down on unders. That Smiley man, two health he has. So that is... That is very, very nice. And then Lukey with the bomb. They're going A. It's been called for. They know that Simo is at least... At, they know that there's one at each bomb site now. Baz has a lot of work to do if he's, if he's going to be staying at A. They don't really know where these boys are going to be going. Lukey P is, uh, if we switch to him now, is pushing through Palace. Smiley's still sitting at that step area of the A ramp. 
Hound is with him in Palace. This will be very interesting to see how these two players deal with him, with Baz, because he's over by the jungle. He's not making a lot of movement. He knows that they're coming. The, the smoke's gone out. That'll mean Simo's moving very fast from him. Now Baz pushing in to get a nice little area from a uh, nice little viewpoint from these stairs, looking over towards to see who he can see. Still a lot of smokes. The second smoke has come out. That's that's damaging for him. Simo's been able to push in through the smoke but hasn't been able to find a player. He's just been taken down by one. Hound now pushing around the corner. He'll get the connector kill in the form of Baz. That was who we expected to take a man down. He wasn't able to. At least now Broomstone are able to buy something. And, uh, well, I mean, Andy was able to buy an orb. So it's going to be... I mean, if they go into mid, they're going to be absolutely shut down by this kid. Yeah, and he's... Oh, he's not even going into head. mid. No, no, I was about to say, I, I oh, wanted wow. to watch him. Um, he's heading into the B, uh, the B uh, apps section, and he's going to chill out as the action's coming very quick in the mid section. Frags go out, and it's just leaving two CT players with the Brimstone players left, so Real Mint have got the upper advantage, absolutely dominating it, and now they're working into the B bomb site through the cat section. Anzo gets the one. He knows they're coming, Ooh. and they're back straight off because it's an AWP that's dominating them as he picks the second and smiles. Hound and Metal Snake left. Wow, what a round from um, Anzo. He pretty much picked up the two, equal out the frags. We, we're not over yet, but... um. He's pretty He's much found stopped the bomb that as well. This is this is devastating the real mint because they know Andy's at the back. He's got his sights on the bomb. They have a, they both have smokes. So if they wanted to push it, they can. They look like they're going to because they need to. They've only got 40 seconds left. Is it going to be enough time? The smokes come out from Metal Snake. The flashes as well. He's oh. going to be looking to get this bomb. He does so. Very nice from him. Hound has taken down Seeker. That's a big pickup from them. They really need to take take Seeker down, who doesn't seem to move more than ten meters from spawn. But any either way, he's been able to hold this bomb site, this A bomb site from that box the entire entire time. Andy now has something to do, has a lot to do, in fact, because these boys aren't going to poke him. One sitting at headshot box, the other sitting at CT, very nervous and afraid to poke around to that CT area. Andy pushing through connector. He's not going to be. Able able to see anyone for at least 10 seconds until he gets onto those stairs so it's going to be interesting to whether to see whether buys he's going to, oh he missed oh. the shot that that could have had it oh. if, if he is on the wrong line if he had got that shot he would have been able to push in Jesus not man. enough time unfortunately now real mint are in front for the i think this is the first time this game boys yeah brimstone had the, the early eco rounds at the start of the match so real mint um uh, yeah, real minute. First time in front, Don. It's just it's just so hard to be, if you're a Brimstone fan at the moment, to see them drop so many rounds in a row. Real Mint, very, very wise as to how they're doing it. Metal Snake already has a, a, already has a down over at A when they push him. They know he goes there every single round. He's very aware of that. Seeker has just been tagged a little bit pushing into that ramp area he's only got the p250 he's looking to pick up a gun from the fallen teammate wasn't able to pick it up and now unfortunately has to deal with that retina's also on the save as well over at a so this is a very big save from the boys over at a the b side however has has the orp and uh, that's just about it on this team they want to save that very desperately metal snake with the one metal snake with the two that was on the retina very nice from him he'll oh. get taken down by andy just as the smoke comes oh. andy pushes towards mid takes hound down as well smiles now will uh, push into a they've got a lot of work to do if they want to take this andy down they want to punish him for having this orp so they really need to take him down he'll get flash pops, pops around the oh corner gets rexy as well is this going to be a five down for andy they really need it they need somebody to fire here lukey p very very safe plant from andy they know he's at ct and he might go jungle as well so one watches one way one watches the other he's on the stupid box trying to get up onto the ticket booth he isn't able to do it pops the smoke pops the fire i should say lukey moves back from that smiles also moves back from it as well he's had to drop the off that's devastating he's lost it and now they have it and they want it really bad smart lukey has actually missed picking it up and uh wow I thought, he, I thought he'd pick it up. I thought he had enough time. They didn't have enough time because of where he dropped it by. 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> Are you watching the same about. game I'm watching? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> As oh, we're God. rolling out, it's been a long night. As we're rolling out now yeah, I've lost myself, on the 27, 27th round. Um, um, am I right in saying the 27th round? That is a lot of rounds to do all of this yeah. for, considering that they've just been playing for, for 45 minutes before this. You're watching the Hound pop someone through the smoke and Faz. Ricky P will pop someone around the corner. That's Retina. They're falling into their stride a little bit now, these real mint boys. They're doing the boost into mid. That's from Smiles. He's helping there. And he's got an AWP once again. Spent all his money on it. Unfortunate for him. Oh, he's Simo's on under two frags. Simo's is coming under fire once again as well. He's on B. The solo B hold is from him. He's got a lot of work to deal with. The Seeker's taken down one. That'll even it up a little bit. Simo's taken down Loki. Rexy will also go down to the Simo. He's trying to get the last touch on the man at the van. That's what we expect from pedophiles and not from an esports player. The Simo <laughs> will try to get this touch on the man at the van. It smiles. Oh, He'll go down. Seeker and Andy both in the... He's only got 11 health smiles. He won't survive very long. They will get the bomb plant. That's beneficial for their for their fundage. But uh, they will take the... This is an important oh, round that Bloomstone have just got. Well, they just nipped it in the butt. There was five rounds consecutive from Real Mint. Um, and they were starting to lose. The money was very low. You know, they're even tight right now. So they're forcing up everything. Not even the full buyout on... Um, what can they do? Know. They need a mixed buy. You can't you can't drop rounds yeah. from now. Every round is important round. You know it's exactly right. And uh, the the orp man in, in Anzo, he really needs to pick up a couple early frags and just stop Real Mint from having a bit of domination. Uh, but the, you know the thing is, he's got the orp, but they don't play mid. Like Real Mint have played a bomb site and the B bomb site. They've rarely come through the mid connector. Where you compare Brinstone, they dominated the mid connector. Um, purely because Andy could AWP that section. So it's quite interesting to see how both teams have worked their strats. Really, really different. As I say that, uh, the Andy man, he gets absolutely dinked down to 5 HP. He's now on the back foot, so Real Mint now do have the advantage because he's not going to play the aggressive role. They are working the big bomb site uh, very slowly through the app. Smiles with the, with the bomb. I think they want to try and cause a rotate. They do have a free stack at the A bomb site and the CTs and Brimstone. So 45 seconds ticking. They're going to start working as Metal Snake does his usual at the A entry of the ramp. It binks the crap out of Seeker at the box as they will try to work the B bomb site. That's real mint. Babs picks up the Metal Snake. The Hounds work into the connector. Now going Retin and Simo, Luke and Rexy both down for real mint. Smiles gets into the site. Brimstone with the advantage. As Smiles onto Retina. They're sitting in the house pushing out. The bomb is what dropped it is dropped so the last player in the hound is in the jungle section he's going to come up against the baz will pick him up and he tries to go for the big through the uh the hole the good old ninja hole and enzo's waiting for him so another round down and brinstone picking up two up in the road don mega this is close can brinstone pick this up and take us to a third you're seeing the AWP now come out in the hands of Lukey P. He's going to be doing something different with it, though. He's not going to be doing the usual sitting in mid for hours on end. No, we're going to go for a hard and fast push into A. This is the sort of stuff that we like, and we like to see the hard and fast pushes. Sort the men from the boys as we're watching the the well, not really pushing, still. Mate. And the uh, well, it's a hard it's a hard and fast push more than we've seen in the previous round. I must say, the seekers still look, looking at that box. They've only got these two players on this on this A site now, and Baz knows that there's someone in Palace. He's heard him. He's smelled him. He can see him. Well, he can't see him, but he can smell him anyway. Nonetheless, these boys stacking up now, what, waiting. For this uh who are they waiting for i think it must be lukey p to get this first frag he's looking over towards the stairs area he's not going to find anyone there the smokes and the flashes all go out he's too nervous to look over towards cp that's where he'll find a player does a little bit of a, a oh big shot on bass he'll get d taken down by the seeker the smiley will try to tr pop around the corner try to take him down seeker on 23 health he'll go down for the kobe andy will uh, come to exactly where seeker was he'll pop up onto this onto this uh actually doing a very nice little uh 
Very nice little fighting hole here. They'll fire up through the smoke, however, and take him down. And he popped up onto that ticket booth and popped smoke right as he was standing. I don't know what the point of that was, boys, but to eat up some time, to hide, maybe? I mean, there was three dudes. You know, you need to... You need to be able to do so. Oh, we've actually hit a pause. Brimstone CS. What are they doing? Well, what are they doing? Brimstone really needed that round, and they know that they needed that round. Now, Real Mint are one round away from sealing it. I desperately, desperately wish we could take you into the... I mean, that would defeat the purpose, obviously. But I desperately, desperately wish we could take you into the... Uh, into the where we're having this little chat between these two boys so intense so much going on here so much so much time to go and visit gamestar on their social medias <laughs> see that little segue that, that was a nice coming. yeah that was a nice yeah, little segue yeah you brought okay. you brought that in mate you actually brought that in big shout out to the guys on twitch right now a good old nine spectators. I love that. We've got we've got some people watching. <laughs> GameStar usually, usually Media. Uh, to the boys on Twitch, if you haven't already, head on over to GameStar Media on YouTube. That is where you'll find matches like this and many, many others. And uh, you should also, while you're there, while you're uh, having the time of your life, head on over to GameStar on Facebook, press the like button, and that will follow you and keep you up to date. Mostly we, we repost stuff that smarter people have posted. But uh, every now and then we post something magical. And at GameStar on Twitter, as we head back to the action once again, we've got Seeker doing something completely different from what he was doing. We've got them all pushing towards this mid area. This is a complete oh. upset from this Brimstone oh. team. They are doing something completely different. I love when teams do this. It's either going to work or spectacularly fail. And that is Simo going down in mid to Hound. Hound will push up. He'll get taken down by Baz. He'll get replied on by Rexy. Rexy will push back towards this apps area. He's got the bomb. Doesn't want to risk losing it in this mid area. And he's all... Is, uh, is one of the players left for his team being flashed. He's got the famous neutral net pushing around to see if they are on this bomb, this A bomb oh. side. It's Metal Snake as he would. Retina pushing towards the A bomb side. He's heard the, the shots go off. He doesn't realize that they are coming up and towards this where Metal Snake is. So, they got to split up. Yeah, so what is happening in these boys' heads is they think that all this time has passed. It must be a B. We have to start pushing back towards this B. They're both looking at A, but they are both in positions where they can hear bomb sites go down. And he's just been flashed. Retina's going to move in now. He's going to try and get the gun before he pushes in. Good boy. That'll be beneficial from you. Rex, you will push in. Andy Zora will get the one. Andy Zora will get the two. Lukey's there. He'll get the double. That'll be Lukey saving the day. That'll be him getting... Getting the round, the GGs go out 16 14. And as you can see, Lukey with the 30, and uh, the other, the 32 was in the hands of uh, who was it in the hands of? Seeker was in the hands of Seeker as oh. well, looking over towards this uh, the end of this. So, real men continue now, they are eight and zip. Brimstone have just been pushed to seven and two. Brimstone were number 12. Real men are number seven. Obviously, deserve to be a little bit higher. Boys, I mean, for the for the last map, you can't go past MVP Seeker. He held A all by himself. Mm, dominated so it. goddamn well. I'm just so impressed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I couldn't agree much more, mate. I'd... And one thing I don't like about CG when they end this map, they disappear really quickly and we can't get a hold of the scores and, and who's done what and talk about the guys. Yeah. It's really sucky on that half. It, it, it is, but you, you do know that uh, a couple of shout-outs go to Seeker, obviously, that we've talked about, then the Metal Snake on the first map. He was absolutely brilliant. And Smiley, the amount of times that he was just in the right place at the right time to get a couple of doubles to save the round, that was absolutely brilliant from him. I can't spruik it anymore that he has some of the best game awareness that I think we've seen so far. Definitely, mate, definitely. Um, what, I was gonna, what was I going to do? Big shout out to everyone watching. <laughs> Yay! All right, it's, so uh, we've yeah. spruiked our uh, our social I've medias spruiked, enough. I've spruiked myself, mate. <laughs> At Buyser nineteen eighty nine on Twitter. We're gonna get out of here. My name is Don Mega. That was uh, Buyser. 
the Get man up. screwing up all the names. This was GameStar TV. You can chat to us on Cybergamer or wherever you can find us. All the links are there. If you need to request a cast, it doesn't matter what sort of league you are in. We will come and cast your game. That is the beauty of it. We go where you want us to go. This is GameStar TV. Thank you for tuning in and good night.